so as we have discussed how to solve this question in the last class i am just checking the answers okay so now you also check third part so 5m whole square plus 3 square 2 3 5m after that uh, make sure you write that step also 5m plus 3 whole square okay this is correct this is 49 7 by whole square 36 z whole square 2 into 7 by 6 z 7 by plus 6 z correct good Write full identity. A square minus two b plus b square equals to a minus b whole square. Okay. Okay. This is two x. This is two. So two x minus two. Two x minus two. Y it is plus. Sir, so because uh, I thought that was the identity. What is identity? So two x. So when you expand it, isn't uh, one of the brackets doesn't it have a plus symbol? Aaron, what is x square? X square is x into x. So is it minus x plus x? No. So. Okay. If it is a whole square, don't rectify things. Power is there; it will be same. Yeah. Okay. So, so I'll correct that. That was in another. I made mean, that mistake in another question as well. Hmm. So one twenty one, eleven sixteen is four. Eleven B minus C four C. This is correct. This part is incorrect. Next part is incorrect. I'll do it for you. Seventh part. L plus m whole square minus four l m. When there is no property happening, so make sure you open it first of all. A square plus B square plus two AB minus four LM is already there. These two are like terms, so we will solve them. Two minus four will be minus two LM. Now identity will happen. A square. Plus b square minus two ab. Is it making sense? Which is l minus m whole square. Therefore, l minus m, l minus m, are the factors. Is this thing clear? Okay, so, so basically we have to rearrange the term. Solve, simplify. Yeah. Okay. Okay, quickly copy this part. Wherever you stuck anywhere, that question becomes important for you. Okay, make sure you mark that question in box. Eighth part again very important question and very well done. And power four can be written as two power two. Power four can be written as two power two. Two AB. So identity becomes A plus B whole square. So we will expand A square plus B square A square plus B square. So. Again, very very important question. 
so before moving ahead in question number 2 is there any doubt as of now 